Elizabeth. You will be taking a leave of absence, effective as soon as you can make it happen. Excuse me? No, you were much too vulnerable in this environment. Well, the communal germs alone would turn one's stomach. Now, once you deliver a healthy child, do you please can do just leave me alone? That was pretty clear. You back off, Elena. Oh, run along, little boy. I'm having a private conversation with the mother of my great-grandchild. It wasn't a conversation. Helena has ordered me to leave my job. But it was for your own protection, my dear. I don't need your protection. And I'm telling you, if you disrupt my life in any way, I'm going to have you arrested for stalking. And I'll gladly serve the warrant. Just stay away from me. Poor, silly you. I was still letting her pull you around by your... Heartstrings? Don't make the mistake of thinking I'm like my dad. Sparring with you isn't a thrill for me. I don't find you charming or amusing. I think you're sick and you're dangerous. And you should be put out of your misery, something I'd be happy to do if you push me. You harm one person who matters to me, and I will show you one of two things. The inside of a prison cell or a coffin. Nothing gets my blood pumping more than a fresh breakout of the spencer Cassidyne War. Soon a vernacular that you will understand. Bring it on. <laughs> this quick. Maxie called you in as a potential suicide. What? If she urgently needs you. Potential suicide. How about potential murderer? It's my uh, sister in there. It's precious cargo. Yeah. Yeah. Don't I know that? You're gonna take care of her, right? The best. Do something about your grandmother, Nicholas. You know, ship her off to one of your islands or throw her back in the nut house. Better yet, take her to a riding trailer, put a bullet in her head, just keep her the hell away from Elizabeth. Hold on. Don't barge into my house and order me around. Helena already told me about your little confrontation at the hospital, so I'm sure you got your white horse tethered just outside. The fact is, Helena, however skewed her intentions may be, is concerned about my child. So it's a family matter. And since you've made it abundantly clear that I no longer fit that bill, butt out. Not that I'm obligated to explain myself to you, but I've opted to keep Helena close as a preventative measure. If Helena stays in town, Elizabeth won't have any peace. Do you understand that? She's still too fragile. You're mishandling the situation, Nicholas, and it's going to have adverse effects on Elizabeth, the boys, and the new baby. So just, just get rid of, get rid of Helena. What is this really about? Is it a legitimate concern, or are you just grabbing another chance to be Elizabeth's hero? I'm not interested in being Elizabeth's hero anymore. Okay. Her and I are over. We don't have a future, and you know it. But I'm not just going to stand by and watch Helena. Intimidate, harass, and basically stalk Elizabeth and make her life a living hell. And if you cared about her the way you say you do, you wouldn't either. <laughs>